Hello friends, welcome back to our channel. So in the previous session, we have seen the LRU page replacement algorithm that is the least recently used page replacement algorithm. So in that, so in order to load the required page from the secondary memory to the main memory, so we have to find the free space in the memory. So if all the memory frames are full, so we have to replace one page uh, from the main memory uh, with the required page. Right. So, which page should be replaced depends upon the page replacement algorithms. So, in that we have already covered the FIFO and LRU. And now, in today's session, we will see the another page replacement algorithm called Optimal Page Replacement Algorithm. So, in this situation, so we have to replace the page which is not be used for a long duration in future. Right. So, hope you understood. So we have to replace a page such that that should not be used a long time in future. So coming to the least recently used algorithm, we have seen if we want to uh, load this page, page 2. So we have to select the page which is least recently used. For that we have traveled from the required page towards the left side. And in this, we have to load the page such that I mean, we have to replace the page such that it should not be used long in future. So, we have to travel the same thing in right direction. Right? So, uh, we will solve a problem so that uh, if you are having any doubts, so that uh, those doubts will be clarified. Right? So, here also I am taking the same reference string, so which we have solved in uh, both the FIFO and LRU. The same reference string I have taken and I have taken the three frames. The number of frames are 3. So now we have to find out the page faults and number of ticks. And page fault is if the required page is not available in the main memory, that, that is called a page fault. And if it if the required page is available in the main memory, it is a hit. Right. Now we'll start the solving. So first one. So all the three frames are empty. So we can load the page one in the main memory so i will load here so that means here it's a page fault okay so this is here it is a page fault now next reference string is 3 so again two frames are free so again i am loading it here so again it is a page fault because 3 is not available in the main memory and 2 2 is also not available in the main memory so again it is a page fault and i will load this 2 in frame 3 now 4 Page 4 is not available in this main memory. So, there is a page 4. And there is no empty frame available in the main memory. So, we have to swap in and swap out. So, we have to first swap out the one page from the main memory. And we have to swap in the required page from the main memory to, I mean, load uh, from the secondary memory to main memory. So, for this, we have to select the page which is not going to be used for a long duration in future among these three 1 3 and 2 for that the required page is 4 so travel in this way travel in this way so 2 so immediately we require the 2 3 immediately we require the 3 1 so the third position is 1 so among these three among these three one will be having a lot of time to load so, replace 1 with 4, 4, 3 and 2, hope you understood, right? So, among these 3, 1, 3, 2, 2 is the immediate pay reference page, I mean immediate page in the reference string and the 3 is the immediate uh, page in, after the 2 and 1. So, among these 3, 1 is having, have to wait until it loads the 2 pages. So, 1 will be replaced with 4. Now again 2. 2 is available in main memory. So it is a hit. No page fault. So we need not change any page. We, we need not swap in and swap out the pages. Right. Again 3. 3 is also available in the main memory. So again it's a hit. It's not a fault. So again no need of replacing any one of the page. 
now one one so one is not available in the main memory so it is a page part now we have to uh, replace one among these three pages so for that we have to select the page which is not going to be used for long time see travel towards its right so 4 3 2 so 4 immediately we require 2 immediately we require 4 and 1 immediately so 1 uh, here no not there right 3 so 3 is the 3 in order to load this page 3 into the main memory it requires around uh, 4 iterations right so after uh, loading the 4 pages the next one is a 3 so 3 is wait, waiting time of a 3 is more right so the 3 will be replaced with 1 1 2 and 4 so hope you understood right so among these things 4 3 2 3 is not being used for a long time okay next coming to the 4 4 is already available so it is a key so we need not change anything and the 2 till 2 is also available here so again hit so we need not change here and a 4 4 is already available so need not change again it's a hit 1 1 is already having so again it is a hit and a 3 3 is not there 3 is not there and 3 is a last string last page so after 3 there are no other pages so we can replace any one of the page from the main memory so i will replace one or any any page okay so i will replace the four okay right so if you observe here see so these are the, these are the hits and page faults occurred while loading the page reference string into the main memory applying the optimal page replacement algorithm so only one thing the page should be re the, the replaced page i mean the uh, page which is not being used for a long duration in future that should be replaced with the required page for that we have to travel from the required page towards the rightmost direction rightmost direction right so this is how we can uh, implement this optimal page replacement algorithm so here the number of page faults 1 2 3 4 5 and 6 6 page faults are there and number of hits 1 2 3 4 5 and 6 6 hits are there so this is the procedure of optimal page replacement algorithm hope you all understood this uh, optimal uh, page replacement algorithm let us stop here and uh, if you are having any doubts regarding this uh, page replacement algorithms uh, feel free to post your doubts in the comment section so that definitely I will try to clarify all your doubts and if you really understood my session like my session share my session with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to our channel thanks for watching thank you very much